Hey everyone, figured I should upload something since E3 is now over. Okay, and everyone's also reminded why we have E3. Because game dolls don't really reveal all the secrets at once. Speaking of which, I guess I should say what I'm excited for. And you might be a little surprised. So first off, the uh, Shadows Die Twice game. I forget what the Japanese term for it is now. It wasn't exactly wowed by it. It seemed okay. Nah, that's the word I'm going to use, okay. Not, not great. Not terrible, but that's what I expect. So we'll see. Now, in terms of all the games out there, I wasn't actually wowed too much by everything revealed, but one did catch me off guard, and it is uh, Metal Wolf Chaos. Now you're probably thinking, what the fuck is that game? And I'm not surprised you probably say that, because I'm pretty sure that in terms of the entire gaming populace, less than 2% know the that fucking game. <laughs> see, before FarmSoft made Dark Souls, or even any Souls game, they made Armored Core. And even some of the more hardcore players of Dark Souls scoffed at Armored Core, like, how can you even fucking play that shit, man? Look at that control. Look, the game can, can, can decide on a consistent playstyle. And, yes. You're right. But, it was, oh, I found it awesome. I like big machines. I like mechs. It was a big surprise, right? Anyway, Metal Wolf Chaos is kind of like a spin-off of that. Comedical one, if that. It was Japan only, and it was for the original Xbox. So you already know it tanked. It did not do so good. <laughs> In fact, it did very poorly. And it never came to the West. And it's always been on my bucket list when I get a good higher end PC that can actually run that crap, which I still lack. But I figured, yeah. Yeah. And this this remaster comes along, like, hey, that's pretty good. <laughs> so yes. Uh Generally, for E3, there's a lot of the Souls-like games, and they're, they're interesting in that, but, eh. I didn't wasn't really wowed by too much. Some of it seemed alright. Neo 2 has been also announced, well, I'll, 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 I'll look forward to that. Will it actually be better than the original? Mm, hard to tell, it's kinda, I don't know, Neo kinda I think it peaked for me. I think I did, that's what I did for everyone else, <laughs> judging by the viewer bases I went on with that, that series. But we shall see. Now, no doubt you're still hearing the buzzing, so still running the same shoddy equipment from last video. And hopefully next week I'll have uh, a new equipment to work with, a new console, without such loud buzz buzzing and ringing. And you probably see the footage from the Dark Souls, I have got the original, I will do a video series on it as you, some people probably want. I'm not sure how many, but we'll see. But yeah. Otherwise, uh, with the new uh, soul memory, of oh, facing off players at a high level, and then the weapon memory, I've, or I've had a very harsh learning curve this time around. So yeah, in short, the remaster is alright. I won't call it perfect, it's exactly like the first Dark Souls, which is not perfect. <laughs> but I think that's enough said. Hopefully I'll have a better update soon. Till then, take care.